Welcome Facilities Division to this week's Safety Talk. We're excited you're here this week and we've got a very special surprise for you. We have a special guest, Claire Stevens, is going to be with us this week. And uh, she's from the Energy Systems Utility Distribution Shop. And she's also the chairperson for the Steering Team Safety Committee. So she's going to be talking uh, this week to us about some of the resources that we have at our disposal that you maybe as a supervisor or you as an employee can use. Uh, a few things that we're going to talk about today is our website, uh, how the safety committees are set up, how you can get in touch with us if you would, uh, you need any information. Uh, so just a wealth of knowledge on our website. We encourage you to go and she's going to tell you a little bit more about that. So Claire, uh, we're excited to have you here and uh, what have you got for us today? Thanks, Brian. My name's Claire, and I work in the UD shop, but I'm also a member of the safety steering team. The safety committee is made up of three different teams, the base team, the steering team, and the director team. And really, we're here to take all of your safety ideas, concerns, and suggestions, and try and implement them in a way that makes the facilities division safer. We're also trying to continue moving our safety culture in the correct direction. There's a few different ways that you can contact us. First, you can reach out to one of us directly. The safety committee has wide representation across all of the facilities divisions, so chances are you work with somebody who's on one of the safety teams. If you don't know who that person is, feel free to reach out to myself, Chad, or Brian, and we'll be more than happy to put you in touch with someone. Second, you can contact us from the NC State Facilities Safety website at go.ncsu.edu slash safety. There's a contact us button where you can submit any of your safety concerns, suggestions, or ideas, and they'll come directly to us. Really, we want to hear from you before there's a mishap. You don't have to wait until after there's some sort of mishap or incident to contact us. Ideally, if you, if you see something, please say something. Only if you guys are able to identify safety concerns and bring them to us, can we try our best to resolve them. There's a lot of additional resources on the safety website, one of which is the hazard identification and mitigation steps. That's really the process that we want for everybody to take whenever we're trying to approach a hazard and mitigate that risk so that we can go home safe. Another, op another resource is the safety training that's available for all of us within facilities as well as a list of what's required training for you and your specific department. Hopefully we've been able to provide some additional information that either you weren't aware of or maybe just needed a refresher on. Remember, we really want to hear from you. If you have safety concerns or ideas, please reach out to us, either directly or through the Contact Us form, because we really need you and your ideas to help make facilities safer for all of us. Thank you. Thank you, Claire, for, uh, for all that information. She does a phenomenal job for us, and uh, she's really a, a great asset to have on our team. Uh, and I know that if you reach out to her, she'll be able to help you. But uh, feel free to reach out to, to any of us in safety if you have any questions. We really encourage you to do that because we're here for you. We're here as a resource. And all we want to do is to, to make your job easier when it comes to the world of safety. Uh, but ultimately we want you to be safer, we want you to be able to go home just as safe, if not safer, than you came to work that day. So we want you to always remember, we care about you. That's not just a slogan, it's not just something I say at the end of these videos. Uh, I really do care about you, each one of us cares about you, and we do not want to see you get hurt. Uh, so just remember, go for zero, no one gets hurt, and go pack.